There is no reason to eat meat. Let me show you why. Click the link below to uncover all the secrets. Hello, and today I discover whether you can make a steak without harming a animal. And I have to say, I pretty well come close to it. This is how I did it. Okay, first of all, you're gonna need all these ingredients. Go get them, unless you've already got them. In that case, that's great. Anyway, what you're gonna to need to do is put them all in a blender. If you haven't got a blender, then I haven't got a clue. I'm a very messy cook. Anyway, next you need to roll it out. It'll come out kind of like crumbly, but when you like put your fingers on it, it will stick all together. So, you know, roll it out a couple of minutes until it's uh, in a ball. Cut it into four. You'll get about four steaks out of this. I don't know why I said that, it's blatantly obvious. Anyway, and now what you want to do is roll them out into steak shapes. Well, they'll naturally go that way. Keep rolling them until they're a steak size, width, whatever, thickness, then steam them. 25 minutes should do it. Turn them halfway through, they will expand. I would do them in batches considering my steamer was not big enough, which was a bit of a problem because they kind of like, <sighs> yeah, as you can see. It was a problem, <laughs> but anyway, um, once you eventually turn them around, leave them for 25 minutes, turn the oven off, and they should be quite large and have like a steakish consistency to them. Yeah. Anyway, take your uh, marinade, dip them in marinade, turn it, get them all. What I did was individually get them all done up recipes there as you know that's all you need really leave them for half an hour I've left them for half an hour and I've also left them for hours it was better for leaving them for hours then fry them fry the living daylights out of them get a nice crisp to them look at that shine look at the, the charcoalness the shine upon it that's how it should be basically stick it in your burger and eat Okay then, they were absolutely gorgeous. Trust me, well worth it, either in a bun or on its own. I'm gonna have it on its own next time. Uh, as a bonus, you can uh, slice them down. If any left, there was only two of us, so I made four. So slice it down and really nice on a wrap. Um, also, you can cut them down into nuggets and breadcrumb them, fry them, great nuggets. Um, well worth trying it's really nice really simple and honestly just just give it a go um yeah let me know in the comments what you think consider subscribing because i'm coming up with more and more um either variations or ways of um, cooking better food uh that tastes nice hopefully oh